guys, this is Mark Asagata from Death Angel, and you're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Rock and Metal News update. There's a great video now online as Jimmy K from Canada's The Metal Voice had a recent interview with Testament's vocalist Chuck Billy that was in Montreal uh, on September the 30th. Check out the interview and in the link in the description and it starts at about a minute and a half into the video where the uh, interview starts. On uh, Chuck's, solo, uh, Chuck's solo album that he's been working on, he said, I've got a lot of tracks from different guitar players that have sent me tracks, but there's so much to be done in Testament. I'm still promoting this record, Titans of Creation. It's not time. That's just something I want to eventually and hopefully fit in after. Right after this tour, we have time off until April. So we're going to go right away and start working on the New Testament record. And regarding the New Testament album, he stated October 15th is the last show of our tour. So we'll work right up to Christmas. And then right after New Year's, we'll get right back at it. I know Eric Peterson and Alex Skolnick have been working and jamming together. And I hear there's an epic song that's been created. I haven't heard it yet, but I hear it's epic. That's all they say. It's epic. That's the word they throw at me. So we'll see. I think Testament will always stay in the vein of Testament and not follow trends or follow what's hip today. We want to kind of stay Testament because I hear it from fans when you talk to them. They always say, thank you for being who you are for a long, for so long. So we just have to continue that. So there are some dates uh, left in October for the Bay Strikes Back where Testament, Exodus, Death Angel. Check out those dates in the description and catch the show if you can. And stay tuned. Can't wait for New Testament and hopefully a Chuck uh, Billy solo album. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News. Thanks for tuning in.